Hey YouTube, I'm back with another haul. Uh, got a lot of cool stuff. Uh, yesterday I got Step Brothers on Blu-ray at Walmart. Uh, pretty cool, I've been wanting to get this movie for a while and it was in the 788 Blu-ray bin. Which is the same bin I got uh, the Gamera trilogy out of. You saw that in one of my other hauls, but yeah, Will Ferrell and Jesse Riley, one of my favorite comedies, favorite modern comedies anyways. I really love it. It's it's a really, really cool uh, comedy, but yeah, it was pretty cheap. And another one I got real cheap, Star Trek in the Darkness. I just got back from work, and my work had it for 12 99 new. I ripped off the place I work, because I don't want you guys to... I don't want to talk about my work on the internet, really. Not until I don't work there anymore, but, uh... Yeah. Star Trek Into Darkness. twelve ninety nine Blu-ray new. I sold this at Walmart for 25 bucks last night when I got this. So... And this is my favorite movie of the summer. I thought it was really great, and... To be honest, I don't know which one of these I'm going to watch right now. I got a big stack of comics to finish reading first, but I don't know whether I want to watch Step Brothers or Star Trek Into Darkness. I saw this twice in theaters, and I've seen this about three times. Uh, I don't know. I'm kind of... Uh, I'll think about it. But, yeah, so two new Blu-rays. Pretty tight. And here's something else I picked up. This wasn't for me. This is for a friend of mine. Uh... Let me tell you, I just, wanted, I just wanted to tell you the story behind this. Uh, so he's been wanting to get the three Hangover movies, right? He's heard they're really good, well, except the third one, which I hear isn't very good. But uh, we've been looking for the Blu-ray, right? It just went on sale like Walmart and stuff for like seven eighty eight, and we've been going everywhere. Just me and him looking for it, looking for it, and I was looking for The Evil Dead, and I found it several times, and I kept putting it down because I had just bought a bunch of comic books, or just got an action figure, or just got Power Ranger cards, or something else, you know? Whatever, there's a ton of those. But there weren't any of these, and there were supposed to be, but there weren't. People kept buying them, and right now he only has The Hangover 2. And so, I went to Movie Stop, and I saw this, and he wasn't able to go, because he had to work. Uh, we work at the same place, actually. I have to go work tonight. I say tonight because it's 3 o'clock in the morning right now. But <laughs> I saw this, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to get this for him because this hunt has become personal for me. Like, the whole day while we were looking around, I was looking for the hangover because it had literally... It, it was personal for me. It's personal for me now that we find this movie because I spent so much time looking for it. 2 o'clock in the morning, and the... Uh, the Walmart by the movie theater, and just after we saw through the Dark World and stuff, but oh man, I'm so glad we got him this, and we'll probably watch it later, and then the second one, and then he'll get the third one if he enjoys those, I suppose. Since it's newer and still pretty expensive, but yeah, just eight bucks that Movie Stop used for this uh, unrated Blu-ray. That's pretty tight. I know I don't normally show action figures in this haul, but this figure isn't for me. I got this for my buddy uh, for his birthday. It's coming up soon. And, uh, you know, I wanted to get him a different figure, but the comic shop that I was going to get it from is changing locations, and they had it last time I was in there. They had multiples of them. And then, uh, I guess he was pa they'd have been packaged up. I guess they'd been packaged up. But I got him this, the next best thing. I think he'll really love this, because I know he likes Diamond Select figures. And uh, we're both huge Trekkies. We love Star Trek. We love the original series. And this is from the episode The Devil in the Dark, one of my favorite episodes of all time. And I need to get this figure for myself as well. Uh, it's uh, from the new Star Trek line. It's got Spock, and he can mind mold with the Horda, and it's got this great stand and everything. And I think he will really, really love this uh, this figure, actually. See, it's the stuff it can do, and the Kirk's really awesome as well, fighting Khan in the episode Space Seed. <laughs> yeah, quite a, I, I know all the episode names. That's pretty, it's pretty good, but uh, yeah, I think he'll really love this, actually. So the last two things I showed you weren't for me. I, got, I picked something up for a friend, and I got another friend a birthday present. But this, this is for me. This is the uh, Batman Court of the Owls book and mask set. I really only got this for the mask because I have the book. 
the book's just the paperback, the paper trade of volume one of Batman from the New 52, which is by like Scott Snyder and Greg Capullo, Greg Capillo, I don't know how to pronounce his last name. Great team, uh, great comic series. I'm following it and it's fantastic. I love Scott Snyder, oh my gosh. But uh, yeah, I, I showed this in a comic book collection update as well. So, you know, whatever. But this is a, actually a really, really cool. I've been wanting a mask like this for a while. And now I, ha I have a good suit and stuff to go with this too. So I have I can do a full Court of the Owls uh, thing next time I go to Dragon Con or a convention or something. I'm going to go Court of the Owls. I'll be Court of the Owl in it. I'll be owling. But uh, yeah, really cool. Really love it. Uh, I just, wow. I really do like this. Alright, so at my work we have a video center and uh, of course Man of Steel just came out. I'm filming this on the 13th. It came out on the 12th of November. And uh, the video center was promoting it. it. had all these buttons that the video people were wearing and uh, my work partner and I went up to video and we're like, hey, we want those buttons. Those buttons are fly. We, <laughs> we need those buttons. And we got the last two. So Got this cool Man of Steel button I get to wear on my uniform, which is pretty, pretty awesome. But yeah, we got a bunch of copies, two to special edition DVDs, Blu-ray. Uh, I was going to get it, but <sighs> didn't, I didn't get it. <laughs> yeah, I was beaten to it, actually. I went there to get it the day it came out, but they sold really fast, to be honest. They, uh. They're all gone now. I mean, I was working today, and we don't have a single one. I was talking to the girl at video, and she was like, we don't have any more. And I was like, oh, no, I guess I got to go to Walmart. So I'll probably go to Walmart and get this tomorrow if I can after my classes. So uh, let's see how that turns out. And I got it. Yeah, this version was a little more expensive than the one I wanted to get. It's the Walmart exclusive kind of steel bookish one. Really nice. Uh, it's got the same four hours of special features with some Walmart exclusive special features. I'm, as I said, a film major, so special features are sometimes the only reason I buy a film <laughs> or a version of it. But, uh, yeah, really happy about this. Lots of people didn't like it because they say it was Henry Cavill's character was very uncharacteristic of Superman, but he's not Superman until the end of the movie, so you really can't judge him uh, by Superman's standards if he's not Superman, can you? But, yeah, pretty cool. Uh, I might review it if you guys want me to. I'll talk a little about that later. And right here, I got this at uh, Best Buy. Robot Chicken DC Comic Special, about like 12, 13 bucks. Uh, totally worth it. I love this. It's got like 13 cut shorts on it or something like that. Yeah. Really classy. Very, very cool. Uh, I love this special. It's hilarious. <laughs> and I'm a huge DC Comics guy, so... Yeah, I'm probably going to end this haul here. Uh, I almost got All-Star Superman and Superman Doomsday today, but the line at the store at Toys R Us was so long I didn't, uh, I didn't get them. But yeah, that's it for this haul, you guys. And I just want you to know that if you like these hauls, from now on they will be on my new channel. Uh, it'll be in the link in the description below. Link to my new channel where I'm going to have vlogs and haul videos for comic books. Uh, action figures and DVDs, Blu-rays, all this stuff. And, um, yeah, just all kinds of other cool stuff. You know, uh, my living with Batman, Batman parody things, uh, two spin-offs of my hit show on my first channel, Godzilla and Gigan, uh, Ask Godzilla and Gigan, and then some other stuff, a, a spin-off. Um, yeah, I mean, <laughs> it's gonna be a lot of fun. So, uh, sure to subscribe to that channel. I would love your support. And, um, yeah, that's just, that's it for this haul. If you want to discuss any of the stuff in it, feel free to hit me up in the comments. And, uh, I'll see you guys on my new channel, I suppose.